Hey guys, it's Pat. Welcome to another evening with me. It's been a couple weeks since I tried this format. Some of you seemed to like it, some of you didn't, so I thought I'd try a few more times, see what happens. As you've noticed, I have no set schedule for any of these videos, so they may be sporadic for a while until I can get them dialed in to what I'm really wanting to do and say. But I will be honest, this past week, I've come to the conclusion that I'm getting bored here in the condo. And I know what a lot of you are thinking. Well, you just bought the condo, you sold your pod. What'd you, what are you doing? And some of you know, most of you know, I hope that I moved back to Wichita to be closer to family because my parents are in their 80s. They're needing a little help more than not anymore. So I moved back home to try to help where I can, when I can, with them. That's why I'm here. So that's why I bought the condo. Now, with that said, yes, I'm getting bored being in one place. I've had jobs here for over a year now. I've lived in the condo for almost a year now. And as of late, I've been looking at properties online, rural properties that are suited for camping or parking an RV or just getting away from the city in general, which I think would be really nice. Now the problem is, in some of the places I would like to be with that, they don't allow that because of county rules or state rules or whatever. Now I found a piece of property in North Carolina that has no restrictions so they don't care if you park an RV on it or go camping or just leave it empty or build on it or whatever you want to do. So I'm exploring possibilities like that right now. Don't know if I will do it. Don't know if I won't do it. That's kind of where my head's at at the moment. Like I said in the last video, I, I work here. I've got a job here. I like the people I work with. Helping my folks out. I don't mind that. I like that. It's just being... The feeling of being stuck in one place after the last six years, seven years of just being able to pick up and go. You know, I worked in the state of Washington for a year or two. I worked in California for a year. I was out in Las Vegas for a few months. I was in Oregon for a few months. And it was really kind of nice knowing in the back of your head that you had that freedom of, okay, I've done what I could here. It's not quite working out, so I'm going. That's kind of what I'm missing. Now, with the uh, flip side of that, having a home base is nice. I know that I can leave and come as I go. It's in a secure building, so it's not like it's going to get broken into. So I'm trying to play that fine line of where I want to be in life in the next three to five years. And honestly, I will probably be here in Wichita for the next three to five years. Maybe, maybe longer, maybe shorter, I don't know. But now, in order to help out where I need to be helping, that's my game plan. I've got to leave it open enough to go with the flow, so to speak, with what has to be done, what how not has to be done. But beyond that, I do have some plans. Well, I, really, I don't know if you should, I should really call them plans, but here we go. As far as Wichita is concerned, I am going to make the best of it. I've been decorating the condo. Some of you have seen some of the little clips and bebop stuff. I've added some more artwork. I will try to get that online 
and show you. I've posted some of it on Facebook. I'm not real big on Facebook. I was like absent from it for over a year and just in the past couple of weeks I've been kind of back on it. So just know that it's going to be a hit and miss if I post anything. Eyes are watering. So keep that in mind as well. If you want to check out my Facebook page, go for it. Like I said, I don't post a whole lot there anymore. The last couple of weeks, it's just been silly stuff. I need to get back to dedicating it more to my business side of doing readings and stuff like that. But we'll see what happens. But my main focus, I guess, is just making the condo fun. Something I want it to be. So I'm slowly working on that. Really, that's all that I've got going on in my world. I guess I'm going to cut this here, call it a short video, and figure out what the next step in life will be. This, like I said, is just an update format I'm trying out. wanted to give you guys some more ideas of what my life is right now and why I kind of did what I did. And... We'll get there. I'll get there. And who knows what the next five years will bring. It might be some really fun adventures. I may still be needed here. I don't know. We'll see what happens. So until next time, thanks for watching and be safe out there. Bye-bye, guys.